that's right we're back for the second tutorial this week <laughs> this time it's a unicorn halloween tutorial inspired by the new color pop and my little pony collection so i hope you guys like it let's get into it i was doing some unnecessary forever 21 shopping and found these stickers so i'm going to use those to kind of create a barrier for where i want my eyeshadow to go to prime my eyes i'm using the maybelline color crayon in the color lilac lust I am going to be doing a full lid of color, so I'm just kind of moving this product out from my lid to my crease and a little bit of my brow bone, but I am going to be using a non-purple shade or a non-colored shade for that. Moving on to eyes, I'm using this adorable ColourPop and My Little Pony Collection collab. It's so cute. Going in with the color Minty all over my lid, and I'm using my fingers to apply that because I just didn't feel like using a brush. On top of that, I'm going to put the ColourPop Super Shock Shadow and the Ultra Glitter. This is the color Sunbeam. And I'm just going to apply this color to my crease. Switching back to the palette, I'm using the color Sky Dancer, and I'm also going to put this in my crease. For my brow bone, I'm using the color Bluebell. And in the inner corners of my eye, I'm using the color Snuzzle. And just like that, brows are done. If you want to see a full brow tutorial, I have one on my channel. For this look, I wanted to create a pretty dramatic wing, so I'm using the Sephora Liquid Liner. I'm basically going to draw that wing all the way out to the tape and kind of use the tape as my guide for where I'm going to put the wing. For mascara, I'm using the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara, which is quickly becoming my favorite mascara ever, actually. Applying falsies now, I'm pretty sure these are the Huda Beauty Samantha number no. sevens, but I'm actually not really sure. I think they were whatever was laying on my desk at the time. <laughs> Moving on to the skin, I'm using my Farsali Rose Gold Elixir, as always. And it ain't a unicorn tutorial unless you're using your Farsali Unicorn Tear, so I'm applying that to prime my face. Now I'm going to go in with the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Soft Matte Longwear Foundation. And in my last tutorial, you guys saw me use the color 380. In this tutorial, I'm using the color 360. To conceal, I'm using the Shape Tape from Tarte, and this is the color Tan. contour I'm using my KKW Beauty contour stick and this is the darker side. Important to note that I am using the deep kit. Setting my contour with the NARS Contour Blush in Gianna. For my blush, I'm using Max I'm a Lover, and I'm using these adorable brushes from the collection from ColourPop. Setting my under eyes with this Laura Mercier translucent powder and any areas where I might get oily, so usually under my eyes and along my T-zone. To highlight, I'm using the Milk Makeup Space Jam Holographic Powder Quad, that was a mouthful. I'm using the color pink to highlight the tops of my cheeks and around my temples. So I'm going to take that highlighter down the bridge of my nose and on my cupid's bow. To line my lips, I'm using this ColourPop lip liner in the color R and B. Adding some Farsali drops to keep my lips moisturized. And then I'm going to go in with the color Pinwheel from the My Little Pony Color Pop collection. This is their Ultra Matte Lip.
From the same collection, I'm going to top it off with their Ultra Glossy Lip in the color Dream Castle. To line my lower lash line, I'm going back in with the palette and I'm using the color Sky Dancer in Princess Sparkle. Now it wouldn't be a unicorn without a little bit of glitter, a little bit of sparkle, so I'm using this NYX Cosmetics Mixing Medium and I'm just going to dab that on the places where I want to put this glitter. Carefully just placing this on, I'm a person who, as you guys know, has really sensitive skin, so I have to be careful what kind of uh, makeup that I put on my face, so like painting my whole face white or, you know, whatever everybody else gets to do on Halloween is just not in the cards for me. This is the best way to be able to do what I want to do and get this kind of a look. Then once I've set my face with my Tatcha Dewy Skin Mist, that is it, and I hope you guys love this look. If you do, make sure you leave me a comment below, make sure that you're subscribed. Oh, there's Stefan. <laughs> Anyways, y'all, hit that like button. Let me know if you want to see more colorful looks like this, and I'll be back again with another video soon. Bye!